Part 1. Listen to the full conversation. Hey, have you made any plans for New Year's yet? Yeah, I'm thinking of going on a short trip. How about you? That sounds cool. I'm also considering a getaway. Where are you thinking of going? I was thinking of visiting a charming town nearby. What about you? Nice choice. I was leaning towards a beach destination. Sun, sand, and all that. Oh, that sounds relaxing. When are you planning to leave? I'm aiming for the 30th so I can welcome the new year in a different place. What about you? I was thinking of leaving on the 31st, just in time for the countdown. How are you getting there? I'll probably drive. It's not too far, and I like the idea of a road trip. How about you? I don't have a car, so I'll take the train. It's convenient, and I can enjoy the scenery. True. Trains are pretty comfortable. Where are you staying? I found a cozy Airbnb. It's affordable and close to the town center. How about you? I booked a hotel by the beach. I splurged a bit, but I think it's worth it for the view. That sounds amazing. What are your plans for New Year's Eve? I'm hoping to find a beach party. Celebrating under the stars sounds perfect. How about you? I'm more into a cozy vibe, maybe a local pub with some live music. What about activities during the day? I want to explore the local markets and maybe try some water sports. How about you? I'm thinking of visiting historical sites and taking a long walk in the town. Do you have any travel tips? Definitely pack some sunscreen and a good book for the road. Anything you'd recommend? A portable phone charger and some snacks for the train ride. Got any must-see places? Check out the lighthouse and the seafood joints by the beach. And you? I heard there's a beautiful old church and a charming park. What's your New Year's resolution? To travel more and experience new things. How about you? Same here. And maybe learn a new hobby. What's your favorite thing about traveling? I love meeting new people and trying local food. What about you? Exploring different cultures and capturing moments with my camera. Do you speak any other languages? Just a bit of Spanish. It comes in handy while traveling. How about you? I speak French and a bit of Italian. It helps with navigating around. What souvenirs do you usually buy? Fridge magnets and postcards. They're easy to carry. What about you? I collect local artwork and sometimes try regional snacks. Do you plan your trips in detail? I like having a rough plan, but I'm open to spontaneity. And you? I'm more of a planner. I research a lot and have an itinerary, but I leave room for surprises. What's your dream destination? I've always wanted to visit Japan. The culture and landscape seem fascinating. How about you? Australia is on my bucket list. The wildlife and the Great Barrier Reef are calling me. Any travel horror stories? Once my flight got delayed for hours, but that's about it. How about you? I lost my luggage once, and it took two days to find it. Not fun at all. What's your favorite travel memory? Exploring a hidden waterfall in Costa Rica. The serenity was unforgettable. And yours? Watching the sunrise over the Eiffel Tower in Paris. It was magical. Do you prefer solo travel or with company? I enjoy both, but there's something liberating about solo travel. And you? I like the company. Sharing experiences makes the trip more memorable. How do you deal with jet lag? I try to adjust my sleep schedule a few days before. And you? I power through the first day, stay active, and adjust gradually. What's your go-to travel snack? Nuts and granola bars. They're easy to carry and keep me energized. How about you? Fruits and a good sandwich. Healthy and satisfying.
What's the most challenging part of travel for you? Probably the language barrier at times. How about you? Getting used to different time zones messes with my sleep. What do you miss the most when you're away? Family and home cooked meals. And you? My pets and the comfort of my own bed. What's your advice for a first time traveler? Be open minded. Try new things and don't overpack. And you? Plan ahead, but leave room for spontaneity. And always have a backup charger. What's your next travel destination? I'm thinking of exploring the mountains next. And you? A road trip along the coast sounds appealing. Well, hope you have a fantastic New Year's trip. You too! Safe travels and enjoy the adventure! Practice session. Let's practice together. I'll go first. Hey, have you made any plans for New Year's yet? That sounds cool. I'm also considering a getaway. Where are you thinking of going? Nice choice. I was leaning towards a beach destination. Sun, sand, and all that. I'm aiming for the 30th, so I can welcome the new year in a different place. What about you? I'll probably drive. It's not too far, and I like the idea of a road trip. How about you? True, trains are pretty comfortable. Where are you staying? I booked a hotel by the beach. I splurged a bit, but I think it's worth it for the view. I'm hoping to find a beach party. Celebrating under the stars sounds perfect. How about you? I want to explore the local markets and maybe try some water sports. How about you? Definitely pack some sunscreen and a good book for the road. Anything you'd recommend? Check out the lighthouse and the seafood joints by the beach. And you? To travel more and experience new things. How about you? I love meeting new people and trying local food. What about you? Just a bit of Spanish. It comes in handy while traveling. How about you? Fridge magnets and postcards, they're easy to carry. What about you? I like having a rough plan, but I'm open to spontaneity. And you? I've always wanted to visit Japan. The culture and landscape seem fascinating. How about you? Once my flight got delayed for hours, but that's about it. How about you?
exploring a hidden waterfall in Costa Rica. The serenity was unforgettable. And yours? I enjoy both, but there's something liberating about solo travel. And you? I try to adjust my sleep schedule a few days before. And you? Nuts and granola bars. They're easy to carry and keep me energized. How about you? Probably the language barrier at times. How about you? Family and home-cooked meals. And you? Be open-minded, try new things and don't overpack. And you? I'm thinking of exploring the mountains next. And you? You too! Safe travels and enjoy the adventure! Now, let's switch the role. You go first. Yeah, I'm thinking of going on a short trip. How about you? I was thinking of visiting a charming town nearby. What about you? Oh, that sounds relaxing. When are you planning to leave? I was thinking of leaving on the 31st, just in time for the countdown. How are you getting there? I don't have a car, so I'll take the train. It's convenient and I can enjoy the scenery. I found a cozy Airbnb. It's affordable and close to the town center. How about you? That sounds amazing. What are your plans for New Year's Eve? I'm more into a cozy vibe, maybe a local pub with some live music. What about activities during the day? I'm thinking of visiting historical sites and taking a long walk in the town. Do you have any travel tips? A portable phone charger and some snacks for the train ride. Got any must-see places? I heard there's a beautiful old church and a charming park. What's your New Year's resolution? Same here. And maybe learn a new hobby. What's your favorite thing about traveling? Exploring different cultures and capturing moments with my camera. Do you speak any other languages? I speak French and a bit of Italian. It helps with navigating around. What souvenirs do you usually buy?
I collect local artwork and sometimes try regional snacks. Do you plan your trips in detail? I'm more of a planner. I research a lot and have an itinerary, but I leave room for surprises. What's your dream destination? Australia is on my bucket list. The wildlife and the Great Barrier Reef are calling me. Any travel horror stories? I lost my luggage once and it took two days to find it. Not fun at all. What's your favourite travel memory? Watching the sunrise over the Eiffel Tower in Paris. It was magical. Do you prefer solo travel or with company? I like the company. Sharing experiences makes the trip more memorable. How do you deal with jet lag? I power through the first day, stay active, and adjust gradually. What's your go-to travel snack? Fruits and a good sandwich. Healthy and satisfying. What's the most challenging part of travel for you? Getting used to different time zones messes with my sleep. What do you miss the most when you're away? My pets and the comfort of my own bed. What's your advice for a first-time traveler? Plan ahead, but leave room for spontaneity. And always have a backup charger. What's your next travel destination? A road trip along the coast sounds appealing. Well, hope you have a fantastic New Year's trip.